We're here in downtown Port Huron, one day before the Port Huron to Mackinac boat races, speaking with a participating team to find out what it takes to make it safely across the finish line. The Bayview Mackinac race, which began in 1925, is the longest consecutively run freshwater race in the world. Beginning Saturday, July 16th in Port Huron, where racers will begin the long journey to the finish line on Mackinac Island. The gauntlet boat is really all about the crew because our first priority is crew safety, the second priority is making sure that the boat is safe, and the third priority is making the boat go fast. So we really take those, those three pieces of the puzzle and, and work on those, and we're, we're improving the boat performance, but first and foremost is crew safety. Stressing the issue of safety is necessary because when you're miles away from the nearest piece of land, you have to be prepared for anything. Well, the worst one I had was the first one I did in 87. Uh, it was a strong westerly breeze without a storm, but there was 30-foot waves, and quite a few boats broke up, and one actually sank called Tomahawk. We had a situation a couple of years ago where we were hit with a very high gust of wind, and the boat was, was literally knocked sideways. And I had to rely on my crew members, my crewmates, and they had to rely on me. But it's not always trouble on the high seas. We had a chance to speak with one of the newest and youngest members of the team, as well as what it takes to be considered one of the GOATs. I really enjoy it. It's fun. It's something cool. I'm from an area that no one does this. So it's nice to do something rather than just the normal, what everyone else is doing. I really enjoy it, love the people, always have a great time. Well, this will be my 26th this year. I'm a member of the, of the Society of Old Goats. In fact, I'm a double goat. I've done 25 on the Lake Michigan side as well. Uh, people ask, what's the race, is, what it's all about? Well, it's the right of summer. And to be an old goat, like I said, you have to do 25. And the reason they came up with goat isn't anything about being great. It's just the way you smell when you get to the island. You tend to, you race around the clock, so you add and take clothes off, but you don't take showers, you don't change your clothes till you get to the island. So that's really what it's about to be a goat and, a, and doing the race every year. So once you do it, you tend to keep doing it. And like I said, it's a big deal to be a goat. Now that we've gotten some insight on what it takes to compete in the Bayview Mackinac race, we wish all of the teams safe travels and we'll see you at the finish line. I'm Harold Powell with EBWTV.